Hi family, welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for coming back. Today's video is going to be another natural hair video. I'm gonna be showing you two ways to use onions on your hair for massive hair growth. I've seen so many of these videos go around on YouTube and a lot of you guys have been asking me if I have tried it and the answer to that is no. I've never put onion anything in my hair before because it's onion, the smelly food, onion. <laughs> so I've never done that before but a lot of you guys have been asking me to try it out so I started to look into it and I saw that a lot of other youtubers have done it so I was like I need to do this for my audience so we can try it out see if it works and if it does then they can go ahead and try it out so don't you worry I'm gonna try it out see how it feels what it smells like what it does to my hair and I'll tell you guys all about it so you guys can decide if you're gonna try it out or not so if you want to see what this is all about then continue to watch for those of you who are new to my channel, my name is Mercy. I am an RNBSN, and on this channel, I talk about nursing, lifestyle, beauty, natural hair. I do some feminine hygiene. I do a little bit of vlogging, and I just do a little bit of everything. So if you would like to join my family, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button down below, and also hit the bell notification button so you never miss another video from me again. For those of you guys who don't know, my subscribers and I are doing a six months, no heat, no chemical challenge this is all to grow protect and nourish our natural hair a lot of you guys have been asking me if it's too late to join the challenge and the answer to that is no it is never too late to join the challenge so we are in the second month which is the month of july and you can join at any time this is going to change your hair big time so the goal is to add no heat at all no flat iron no curling no blow drying with heat, nothing, no heat whatsoever. On the other hand, as far as products go, you guys know that there's not a lot of natural products out there, but we are gonna do our best to use as many natural products as possible. And that is where this onion thing comes in. Onion has a whole bunch of great benefits, and I'm gonna talk to you guys about all of them in a minute, but today I'm gonna be showing you, like I said, two ways to use onions for massive hair growth. So we're gonna use onion juice, and we're also going to use onion oil. Yes, I'm saying onion as in the food, the stinky food, okay? With that being said, let's get started. So these are our ingredients. These are literally all we need. We just need one red onion, a knife, a cutting board, and we are ready to go. So I'm just gonna go ahead and cut my onions into small pieces, and then we'll move on to the next step. we have it so next thing we're gonna need is our blender so I'm just gonna use this blender I'm gonna further cut this just because I want it to be easy to blend I'm gonna add some water about that much I'm gonna add the lid back on so here we have it I'm gonna be using a stocking cap. I'm gonna use a stocking cap because that's gonna get only the fluid out and not the particles of onions. So this is the stocking cap I'm gonna be using, y'all. I'm just gonna go ahead and open the packet up here. You can use penny holes for this. You can use a cheese cloth, but this is what I have handy. So this is what I'm gonna use. Um, there's two in here, so. So this is what it looks like. There are no holes, which makes it perfect. And then, I'm gonna take the lid off my magic bullet and I'm just gonna pour it in here. And then I'm gonna take this off and there we go. Clean and simple. So family, this is what it looks like. There are no particles in here. It's nice and clean. It's all juice. So I'm gonna go ahead and transfer this to my spray bottle and I'm gonna go ahead and spray it in my hair. 
we're gonna take our spray bottle, gonna add a funnel to it. I'm gonna take my lid and put it on here. And here we go. It's ready to be sprayed on. Okay, family, so we're gonna move on to the next step here. So I have two more pieces of onions here. We're gonna move on to making the onion oil. So I'm just gonna chop this up. Once again, we're gonna use our blender. So I'm gonna add our onion. Again, I'm gonna add some water. About that much, not too much. I'm gonna add our lid back on. I'm gonna add our onions back on. Okay, so in this step, I'm gonna set my pot on the fire. I have my onion juice here. I'm gonna go ahead and add it. So next, I'm gonna add some coconut oil, and this is pure coconut oil. So I'm gonna use this spoon. I'm gonna scoop up some coconut oil, about this much, and then I'm gonna add, I'm gonna add a little more. So this is what it's looking like so far. You want to do this until it's completely brown. That way, the nutrients out of the onions is going to escape into the oil, and that's how you know it's ready. So we're just going to wait a little bit more until it's ready. Okay, family, so this is what it looks like. As you can see, the oil has actually settled to the top, and then the onion juice itself is at the bottom. So I'm just going to go ahead and mix it one more time. See that? This is how you know when it's ready. So then, I'm just gonna go ahead and transfer this to my bottle. So I'm gonna use this. I'm gonna use this stocking cap again. I'm just gonna put it on here. So I'm just gonna go ahead and transfer it to here. So then, I'm gonna take our stocking cap off. And there we go. So this is what we have. As you can see, we have a lot of oil, but we also have some juice in there. So I'm gonna go ahead and transfer it to a bottle. So this is what I'm gonna use to store my oil. You can get these from the Dollar Tree and it comes in the pack of three for a dollar. So it has this right here. So that is how you open it. But I'm just gonna go ahead and open this up Set it here. So I'm gonna use my funnel, and then I'm just gonna to try to transfer my oil into here. Okay, so I think I'm gonna need another bottle for this one. So this is what it looks like, y'all. We have our oil on the top, and we have the onion juice on the bottom. So because we're gonna be putting this in our hair and leaving it in, I definitely don't like the smell, okay? It smells like onion because it is onion. So to cover that, I'm gonna be using this essential oil and this is lemon. I got this off of Amazon. I'm just gonna open it up and put a few drops in here just to cover up the smell. Okay, I'm gonna put my lid back on. I'm gonna shake it up. And this is our oil, y'all. All right, family, so we have our onion juice and our onion oil, and we're gonna go ahead and get started. We're definitely gonna be washing this out of our hair because it's onion, especially the juice, but the oil is gonna stay in because I did go ahead and add some essential oil, and it smells really good, y'all. It doesn't even smell like onion juice. It smells like essential oil. So. This is our onion juice in here. And then this is our onion oil right there. So the onion juice likes to settle at the bottom like that. 
but that's okay because when you go to use it, all you need to do is shake it up like so and voila. All right guys, so we're gonna go ahead and get started here. As you can see, my hair is out. It needs to be washed anyways. So I was like, let me just go ahead and try this onion thing because my hair needs to be washed. Okay family, so let's go ahead and get started here, okay? So I'm gonna go ahead and section off my hair in about, mm, my hair is really curly. See the curls? The curls just get really, really tight. And that's why they shrink up like that. So I'm going to go ahead and part it down the middle here. I'm nervous, y'all. I'm not going to lie. I've never, ever put something so strong in my hair. So yes, I'm very nervous. But it should be okay because I've seen a lot of people do this. And apparently it works. It's supposed to grow your hair like crazy. So we are trying any and everything, not chemicals, but anything natural. We're gonna try it out and see if it works. All right, so I have two sections. I'm gonna go ahead and twist. Second section. And you guys, if your hair is not detangled, please make sure you detangle your hair completely before you try any of these routines, just because you wanna prevent a lot of breakage to your hair. If you don't have aloe vera juice, you can use your favorite detangler. If you don't have that, you can just use water. Water is great to moisturize your hair. Oil doesn't necessarily moisturize your hair, water does. So just spray some water onto your hair. It's gonna help make it soft and manageable. So there we go, those are my two sections, and then we're gonna do this side. Okay family, let's talk about some great reasons why you would ever wanna put onions in your hair. First of all, onion has many, many great properties and health benefits, but let's talk about what it does for hair specifically. Onion contains this very important property called sulfur. The reason why sulfur is great for your hair is because it increases the strength and elasticity of your hair leads to hair growth and healthy hair. Onions also prevents hair loss, it nourishes the hair follicles, it prevents premature graying, and overall, it's going to boost your hair growth. So, if that doesn't convince you, then I don't know what will, but let's continue with the video. Maybe I can further convince you. All right, so we have four sections here. Now we're gonna go ahead and add our onion juice. You guys, I'm very nervous, y'all. <laughs> this is our onion juice. Um, man. I'm gonna use a clip to hold this towel because I do not need it to be moving. All right, there we go. <sighs> I don't know why I'm so nervous. I'm gonna use this hair clip and we're gonna do this. A lot of people use applicator bottles for this, but I just feel like it's gonna be messy and I just like a spray bottle, y'all. So I'm gonna use a spray bottle to just spray it onto my hair because what I wanna do is I wanna completely saturate my hair with this onion juice concussion thing. So here we go. Oh my God, I have onions in my hair. <laughs> All right. Oh my God. <laughs> it smells like onion. Like I don't mind the smell of onions. I actually love onions, but I've never put it in my hair before. <laughs> oh man. Okay, I think that's a good amount. Ooh. It's starting to burn my eyes a little bit. Okay, my hair is completely saturated. I'm gonna go ahead and detangle it. And I'm gonna leave the twist in Whew. when I wash it. You guys, it's burning my eyes. completely 
saturated with onion water <laughs> and my eyes burning so I need to move you guys this one is messy so if you're gonna do this I would say do it on a hard surface so that it's easy to clean afterwards I would also say maybe spread a plastic bag down and also if you could do it outside that would be even better um yeah but it's messy so just be prepared for that and maybe use a t-shirt that you don't really care about and a towel that you also don't care about something you can just wash right away or maybe throw away honestly <laughs> um but yes that is what i would recommend i guess i could have put some of the essential oil in my juice yeah i should have done that oh my god i only put it in the oil because that's gonna stay in my hair but I totally should have added it to the juice as well. All right, so that's my second one. Ooh, we're gonna move on to the back. So we are all done. I'm just gonna take this plastic cap. I'm gonna put it on my hair for about 30 minutes and then I'll go ahead and wash my hair. All right, here we go. We have our onion juice in. This is what I have left. My whole body smells like onion juice. And my towel, ooh, I'm gonna have to wash this separate all by itself. Anyways, let's go ahead and jump in the shower and wash my hair out. All right, family, I'm just gonna go ahead and take this plastic wrap off. And as you can see, I am still dripping onion juice everywhere. <laughs> but anyways, I'm just gonna go ahead and squeeze out the excess onion juice. And this is what my hair looks like, y'all. As you can see, it looks shiny and it looks healthy. Okay, so first thing first, I'm just gonna rinse the onion out with just water. After that, I'm gonna use my favorite shampoo, which is by Cream of Nature. This shampoo is sulfate free. So then I'm just gonna go ahead and wash my hair. As you can see, I still have the twists in my hair. That is because it makes my hair manageable and easy to wash and also dry afterwards. So guys, when you do this, please make sure to repeat your shampoo at least two or three or even four times. You wanna get all of that onion out of your hair. Make sure you get your scalp, your roots, the ends of your hair. Just let that water run through for a very long time. Trust me, you don't want to walk around smelling like onions. For those of you who always ask me how I get my arms so defined, this is my workout. <laughs> I'm just joking. I do work out, not as much as you think, but I do work out. But I honestly think it's genetics. Okay, family, I think I'm pretty satisfied with the shampoo result. So I'm just going to move on to my conditioner. So again, I'm using this intensive conditioner from Cream of Nature. Halfway through this process, I ended up taking all of the twist out because I really, really wanted to get in my hair to rinse all that onion juice out. I don't know, y'all. I don't know if this is going to be my favorite hair growth method just because I am so paranoid about smelling like onions. Maybe the next time I do this, like I said, I'll add the essential oils to the juice and I'll also wash my hair in the sink so that I don't get onion juice all over my body. But overall, I ended up adding more shampoo, more conditioner, and just washing everything out. And it ended up turning out great. So after washing my hair, I'm just gonna go ahead and apply the onion oil into my hair. So this is my onion oil. I'm gonna section off my hair little by little, rub the onion oil onto my scalp and my hair, massage it in over and over, and then I'm gonna cover my hair, let it stay for about two days, and I'm gonna go ahead and completely wash the onion oil out of my hair and use my regular oils. I don't think I can go longer with the onion oil in my hair. Okay, family, that is it for the video, y'all. I finally tried the onion method. 
I do love it because of all the great benefits. The only thing I don't like is the smell. Thank you guys again so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.